K-I-L-R Killer Games All right, everyone, it's another great, entertaining, fun video, at least we like to think so, by Killer Gamer. Better Gamer! 2000, as we play FTL Faster Than Light, and this would be part number three, and we are in the rock section, so could we get rock onage? Maybe. Yeah. I don't know what's going to happen. But let's talk about what happened in part number two. All right, so we entered sector two and we destroyed a pirate ship that was attacking civilians. We didn't have enough scrap to buy weapons, but we were able to upgrade our ship with a second layer of shields. And that's always important. So as we moved along, our ship wound up being boarded by the Mantis, which were nasty creatures to try to fight, but hey, we showed them the power of a space vacuum. <laughs> took out their oxygen. Also took out their uh, teleporter, so they weren't able to teleport back. Oh, too bad. Uh, we also had to fight a rock vessel that was near a sun. Yeah, the fires proved to be too much for them. Oh, yeah. As you can see, they're burning all over the ship there. And we reached the jump point for Sector 3. And as we looked on our map, either choice was going to take us deeper into rock control territory. So, we now begin with sector number three, part number three. Well, part three for the video, but sector three, oh well, same uh -huh. anyway, of FTL, Faster Than Light. Here we are, everyone, back in FTL. Yay. As we continue and sector number three all right we got that cool music going on too so let's take a look by the way if you're wondering what keyboard shortcuts there are there's J for jump which is kind of cool mm -hmm. all right so our exits down here so we can go did it just say side. unwise no I'm oh. I thought it said unwise. So we can go up this way and around, or we can come through, maybe go through the middle, kind of around this way. Huh? Yeah. Or we can go around and go this way. Always go through the middle. Think the middle's good? Yeah. Alright. That's where you get the most action. Alright, let's do this. You see a small trading post and ask about refueling, but they respond, Go away. We don't serve your kind here. Aww. Figures. Maybe it's because we don't have a rock person. I don't know, maybe. Guess we'll go here. Uh oh. The music picks up. You arrive in an asteroid field and immediately begin evasive maneuvers when a loud clunk. Plunk. reverberates through the ship. At first you think the hole's been hit, but the noise came from some rock intruders. Oh no, we're being teleported on. The ship. And there they are. Uh, There's only one guy. Yeah, we can't suck them out in space though. They don't need oxygen. Alright, and they're pretty... Look to see who has high fighting. I know one of them have a high fighting. We may have to take two of them and put them in there. Definitely not, uh, Chris. Um, these guys are weak. So. Take him out of there then. Oh, wow. He's like at 70. Yeah, so I'll keep him in there, but I'm going to bring. Let's bring these two guys over. Meanwhile, let's start doing some damage. They don't have a teleporter, but... Well, then how'd they get over? Eh, it's just part of this uh, story, event, whatever. <laughs> um, let's hit their weapons. Turn on auto-fire. Auto Alright, let's get busy here. Keep an eye on our hit points there. I am. 
Felicity is getting down. I can see that, but we almost got them down too. Felicity, let's get you. Yeah, she's not doing too good. Get you over there. Hey, Matt. Oh no, that's Bones. Okay. He's actually doing pretty good. Yeah, he is. I think he's the one with the high fighting. You need right. to heal him. Okay, their weapons are... Nope, we need to attack them some more. Felicity, go back in here. Um, let's bring you out here for a moment. Oh, look at the fire. It just hit oh, over there. Man. Bones, let's get you back into the weapons room. Alright. Let's take out their shields. And their engines. They might try to escape. Put him back in there. I don't think they'll try to escape. I love how the rocks try to take out the fire. They're like bouncing on them or something. Yeah, they are. They're bouncing on the fire. Yeah, they're stomping on it. Because they're rocks. That may That's funny. Man, look at all this fire. <laughs> the rock ship hails. Enough! We were told aliens were a threat to our ways, and you have proved as much. Take this and leave us in peace. No! We can get five fuel, four missiles, and 16 scrap. You know what? That's not too bad. Look how much fuel we got left. Yeah, but what if we get more? We probably won't. Fine. Let's take it. Go away. Well, now they're neutral. Alright. Well, we're not in a safe area, so we can't do any upgrades. Too Distress. Distressed. Let's go to the one on the top. We'll get right. to more places. Alright, once you arrive at the location of the distress call, a civilian ship hails you. Thanks for responding to our beacon. Our FTL navigation has gone haywire, and we can't plot a course to the nearest depot to get it fixed. Could you lead us there? Sure. Take this bit of scrap as a down payment. We'll use your jump signatures to follow you. You're really helping us out. What if we never take them to the place and we just steal their money? I don't know. That could happen. <laughs> Alright, oh, the rebels are coming. Oh, they want to go all the way over there? Let's yeah. go to the other distress. That's what I was thinking, too. And then... Go down here. Yeah, and then up and there stuff. and over there. A ship without life forms... Oh, within no! A dense asteroid field is giving off the stress call. Shall we investigate? It could be dangerous. Yeah, sure. Let's search for the ship. You find the decaying remains of some kind of ship coated with ice or crystals. You send some crew aboard to explore. Nearly everything is either destroyed or unidentifiable, but one of the weapons appears salvageable. And there's a strange sta stasis pod that catches your eye. Looks like a massive asteroid is in a direct collision course with the derelict ship. You have to pull your crew out, but they want to grab what they can first. What do they take? Do we take the weapon? And any spare scrap, or do we grab the stasis chamber? What's a stasis chamber? There's a person in there. We should take the person. Might be good. We might get an extra crew member. Exactly. Yeah, let's go do it. Your crew drags the pod back to your ship before the asteroid smashes into the ship, shattering through the crystal coating and destroying the ship. The pod appears to be functioning, but you see nothing but shards of crystal inside. Perhaps someone else will know how to open it. Hmm. Don't know. Well, I guess we didn't get a person. Well, we got something. We might be able to find out where to go. We can do upgrades. And there's a store. And there's another store. Yeah, I don't know if we want to go to that one. Yeah, I don't go to that one. But go to that store, and then you can work your way up to where that quest thing is. Yeah, sounds good. Alright, what do we have here? The Rock tolerate a few aliens in their space, but even they seem to respect the wisdom of the Zoltan. A few of them have established a trading post. Ooh, that looks like that would be an awesome weapon, but we don't have enough money! It's a lot. 
Halberd beam. That's kind of like a phaser beam. Um, hmm. Automated reloader. Countdown between weapon shots is improved by 15%. That's always good. Well, we can get it. What do we have that we can We should get more fuel. Yeah, you're probably right. We probably should. There's about three. Let's see what kind of upgrades we can do with the ship. We'll get fuel before you spend any money, because then you might run out. Well, then I may not have anything to upgrade the ship with, either. Well, would you rather die or upgrade and die? No, we won't die. I'm just looking to see what we can upgrade. Oh, we could upgrade here. That's not very much. So we'll upgrade the uh, piloting. That makes FTL jumps faster. And makes it good for dodging. Oxygen, not really too worried about that just yet. Healing would be good. Also, increasing the engines would be good, too. That's going to take a good portion of our money out. Alright, so we've got that. That's, that's a start. Go back to the store here. Probably fixing our hull would be good, too. Put eight. That should be good. We'll fix our hole. Why not just buy the last two? Of these? Yeah. Oh yeah. I guess there is only two left. I wish I could sell the parts that we have. We don't even have. Oh well, we do have missiles. That's right. This would have been cool to have. True. This one too, but is what it is. Alright. I think it was interesting that we could sell that pod. How much can we sell it for? Fifteen. Wow. <laughs> wow. Doesn't really say anything. It has no practical function, but perhaps someone can repair it. Well, I don't know. I don't think we'll be able to. We'll keep it around until it gets in the way. It's in the way. It's in the way. Alright. Let's keep going upwards. We're going to have to go up this way, and then down this way. Yeah. So this is going to be... Interesting. Interesting, definitely. Let's hope we don't get caught this time. A motley collection of rock ships are stationed around this beacon. They look to have resorted to a pirate's life. Defensive maneuvers! Wow! Ooh, and they get a nasty... That's a missile weapon right there. Let's just take the things out. Yes. Wait, did we buy it? Huh? No, we didn't buy anything. It's just their skills are getting better, so... Oh, so they're faster. Time. Yeah, because they're really fast. Okay. I think we got their weapons down. Let's take out their shields now. As he hammers away there. Hmm. Okay, then we'll go back, hit the weapons. Let's go ahead and hit the engines as well. Let's hit the doors. Let's hit the piloting there. What about the weapon? Never mind. <laughs> Goodbye! Bye. Ship explodes, leaving behind a lot, a lot of stuff. We get more fuel. Whoa, look at all that scrap. And a bunch of scrap, yeah. We got 31. Alright, what else we got here? No more stores. Hmm. Well, we might get caught again. We might. Let's, uh... You know, if we add one more... We can have a missile rated a launch too along with our thing. We can uh, easily buy. That's it's gonna take fifty. Plus another twenty five. Which we don't have. What's the fifty for? 
to upgrade the weapon. Oh yeah, because we need that, and yeah, then we need we, that. And then we need more system power. So... But then there is the shields. If we can at least get it up another hundred, and then another... Uh, we need another fifty here. We can bring our shields up to three layers, which would be good too. So we can't really do anything at the moment. Darn it. What's this? Oh, that's right. All our people. Oh, dismiss. <laughs> we don't want to do that. No. -uh. Well, I guess we're going to go this way and around. I think we might make it. We'll see. I don't think... We might make it. You find a disabled rock transport floating near the beacon. You consider stripping it of useful parts, but are uncertain why it's there in the first place. Yeah, let's strip it. You salvage what you can. No one bothers you. <laughs> Yay! And more scrap. Well, that's a lot. We should be able to upgrade the weapons now, but let's keep going. We don't really need those weapons just yet. Not yet. Let's hit the quest. Shortly after you arrive, the ship you were escorting jumps nearby. Alright. Let's go ahead and get where we need to go. We're gonna get caught. No. That, well, look at it. It goes way down there. I think we might just make it. As naturally warlike species with few intergalactic diplomatic ties, diplomatic, whatever, the rock people <laughs> have garnered quite a reputation as fearsome pirates. They stumble across one of their ships and they promptly live up to type. We might actually get real close to getting those shields. Those are good too. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of weapons. Look at all Whoa! That. My goodness! Let's start taking those things out. Those are going to be nasty if they hit us. They better not. Oh, oxygen's out. I can see that. Alright. Take everybody over there. Shields. We want him. In the Look weapon. at who has a higher um, repairing. Okay, we'll get Felicity over there. Alright, that takes... that damages a good portion of them. We just need to keep firing away. We're all out of shields. Oh, it's because of the, um... Power back up! No, it's not that. It's the ion thing has kind of affected them. It locks it. Yay. Now bring up the other two. Alright, we need to take out those shields big time. We need not enough power. That was kind of weird. Oh, jeez, that's why. No, well, that's sealed off. That's not too bad. Yay! Alright, took them out. Look at all this money we have. Oh, okay. It's time to fix some stuff here. You can also draw a window around stuff and select people. I don't know if you knew that. Yeah, I knew that. Alright. Let's go ahead and open up the doors. Whoops. Get in there. Start fixing things. 
You're making the entire place run out of oxygen. Yeah, but it takes it. It makes it slower. It's going. All right. Okay. Let's do some healing. He's good. He's a hundred health. I think it looks like he's good too. Yeah. All right, Felicity, you are going back in here. Bones, you're going in here. Papaluk, Pipaluk, whatever. Let's get Mr. Glowing Guy over here. He's already full health. I'm just making sure. All right. Give him power back on there. All right, as we get our oxygen back up, we're at 97%, 98, 99. So do some upgrades. So 100 here, 50 here. I say let's get our defenses up. All right. Now we got Ooh. some. Ooh, so shiny. Shiny. You can see the little uh, grids going around here. Alright, I think we're ready. Ooh. Told you. But we'll still make it. We'll still make it. Maybe. Rocks. Kinda good that we have those shields, though. Yo, yeah. We're surrounded by dirt and rocks before a long blast is deflected by our shield, and that was no asteroid. It's a pirate. Again. Again. At least this one doesn't have all those weapons like the other one did. And it only has one shield. Yeah, that other one had a lot of weapons. Alright, so we took out their weapons. Let's take out their shields. We already took out some of it. Yeah, I know. We take out those shields, though. They're completely. gone. The, ro the uh, asteroids. <laughs> the rocks will take care of the rocks. <laughs> Bye bye. <laughs> All right, ship explodes, and we get some stuff. Oh, okay. Can't do any upgrades here. Let's jump. Whoa! Yeah, Just so don't even go to that one. Just go straight to the exit. Hmm, we'll be fine. We'll no, be we fine. won't. Yes. Sir. No. 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 The last time you said that, we weren't fine. All right. Thank you. We've arrived at the long range beacon. When the drive is charged, we can go. Yeah. Oh, there's a black market here. You received the message. These are dangerous times. Yada, yada, yada. Oh, now we can start selling missiles and get scrap. That could be good. Because I don't see us using a whole lot of missiles. No. Sell 15. That's what I'm thinking, too. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Now we can even upgrade our weapons if we want, or just hold on to the scrap for the next door. Hold on to it. You never know what you might need. See, we would have been in it. Wow. When we moved back. Alright, let's go to the next sector. Sector number four. We only got one place to go, and that's the Zoltan. Those are the happy people. I don't know if they'll be happy to see us, though. No. All right, we've entered Zoltan territory. The species is not renowned for giving anything for nothing, but you can always be assured a fair hearing. Well, folks, we're here in uh, wait, sector three, sector four. We're in four now. Sector four, yeah. And thus, we will go ahead and uh, bring this uh, episode to a close. Be sure to click like and subscribe so you know when we get the next uh, part of our fun little faster than light story, which hopefully we'll get the next episode faster than light. If that were Most the case. likely not. Yeah, if that were the case, it would already be up. Anyway, uh, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching, tuning, going to YouTube, wherever it is that you're watching this from. And we'll see you next time.